What up and welcome to episode 15 of the unboxing series. So, what up and welcome to this new episode of the unboxing series. And uh, yeah, today I got these two nice packages from Arconia. Uh, first of all, this is not sponsored by them. <laughs> it's definitely not. Just want to clarify that right off the bat. Anyway, um, yeah, we got a small, smaller one right here, and then the bigger one right there. Um, I have a pretty good idea what's in both of these figures, uh, figures in these boxes, but. First, let's take a look at the smaller one right there. We can actually just zoom in on that. So anyway, how has your day been? I hope you had an awesome day. And if not, hopefully this can make it a little bit more awesome for you. And uh, yeah, so <clears throat> myself, right now I'm pretty busy with school. And uh, yeah, just with uh, internship stuff, sometimes it takes forever to find an internship and that's the case for me right now, but it's all good. And if, at the end of the day, I can always take a few hours to make an awesome video for you guys and girls to watch and enjoy. So don't be afraid of that. Just like that, let's open it up. I'm not gonna talk as much as I usually am in these videos, mostly because I'm really tired um, because of all that school stuff and you know the amount of stress that school can bring sometimes. Anyway, um, so yeah, that's it for the box. We opened it, and as you can see, as always, nice wrapping. Paper that no one really gives a shit about. One of you really made me laugh because uh, that that person commented, "He is cursing just like my brother." Something, something like that. And I was just laughing because I was like, "Yeah, I'm sorry if you don't like hearing um, people cursing. This is not the right channel for you." Because sometimes I'm just so happy I accidentally curse, and when I'm angry. I also curse, so yeah. Anyway, that's it. You won't see what it is right now. There is the paper that says what it is. I wanna see that. And that's it for the box. Last time that I threw my box, I hit Woody on my Detolf, which then thought he could fly like Buzz, which was not nice, so I'll uh, still throw it away. It's still just a box <laughs> so anyway um yeah let's take a look at what we got here i already know what these two are let's see if i can do it without using the knife that'd be the best way to do it <sighs> all right there we go and now here we have some nice pops going so that's it for that and now here we have the two figures, which are, of course, the SH Figuarts Pill, Orange, Male, and Female figures. If I get it to focus, that would be nice. So anyway, uh, yeah, I bought these just to improve um, my art, because most of the times, well, you though, for those of the people that have subscribed to me, and if you haven't already, I recommend you do if you like anime and Dragon Ball and that's part of anime but <laughs> Disney and anime stuff you are, have you've come to the right place so definitely hit that subscribe button if you want to if not yo no pressure uh, no problem you know you do what you gotta do um, but yeah for those who are subscribed to me you know that I want to make a uh, manga in the future a Dragon Ball manga to be precise and uh, yeah, in order to get the best awesome fight poses for Okino, Zakuni and Kaelin, my original characters from Dragon Ball, you gotta have awesome poses and that's 
why I bought these figures. So just to improve my art. So that's it for box number one. And now I'll put it back. Well, we won't put it back on autofocus because now we are gonna unbox this box right here. I just have to say, um, just real quick, I know this has nothing to do, I just wanna say it for some weird reason, but I've made two animations in one day. So that could give you a nice um, image on how tired I am, because both of them were fully animated, uh, you know, with 25 frames per second and it was like two minutes well no the first one was two minutes long the other one was four minutes long so that would give you a rough assumption on how tired that got me so that's why I'm not talking a lot also I'm putting background I'm putting music in the background because I think that gives it a way more chill vibe that I really want to give this series so yeah there you go, that was it for the box, for opening the box, and uh, super excited for this. First of all, brown paper that can simply go f*** itself, Whew, I am excited for this. Oh, it all, it's all wrapped in one big, okay, hold up, that's the paper, sorry, <laughs> that was it for the box, let me just... I'll be a little bit more gentle for the box, even though I f***ing hate it, but still. So, that was it for the box, and now the box can simply go f*** itself. <laughs> and yeah, now we're going to take a look at what I got. And I'm super excited because I've been waiting for this for a few months now. This is not the best way to cut it, but whatever. So, first off, boom. Hold up, let me get that nice focus. You, you would think I would be actually be good at this after freaking five years of, of being on YouTube. But anyway, boom. Here he is, SH Figure Arts, Son Goku, Super Saiyan Awakening. This is from Wave 2, I think. When he first came out, I didn't have enough money to get him and uh, well now I do so I'm, I was super excited when they announced that there was going to be a wave 2 of this awesome figure so immediately I pre-ordered him and I can just tell you right now he looks awesome I love it I fucking love it he looks freaking dope he looks just like in the anime love it just just love it <laughs> you know not enough words can uh, Describe how awesome he looks. Then, boom! The Diorama Mansion, a new one. I already made one in the past. I even made a video for that. Link will be down in the description below. It was a really crazy experience for me. And uh, yeah, if you want, if you guys and girls want me to make a build video on this one, just comment it down below, and uh, I will provide the video. <laughs> Anyway, um, yeah, I bought this mainly so I can finally start making figure reviews on the SH Figure Arts figures because that is long overdue. I've been saying it for the last, what, two years now that I, that I was going to make the figure reviews, but I just really wanted to have a nice diorama uh, in order to take nice pictures and just to make the figure review even better. So that's why I bought this one and it was for a nice price, I think it was around $30 on Arconia, so um, yeah, I think they still have a few, so you can go right now to Arconia down below and uh, get one if you want to have a nice diorama. So that's that one. And last but certainly not least, oh my god, it's Boo. Oh my god, he is so big. Hold up, give me a second. I mean, look at him. He is huge. This, like, come on. He's a big f***er. Oh my god, look at this. This is Goku's box. That is nothing. That's like the chocolate that Boo eats. <laughs> you know? 
This is crazy. It's huge. It's almost as big as Broly's box. Damn, he looks awesome. My camera cannot show you the proper size of this boo figure because he is just f***ing enormous. I love it. <laughs> I really love it. It's so hard to get him into frame. But I seriously love it. He is just the pink blob himself. That was really the weirdest saga of all of Dragon Ball. But still, I have him. I'm super happy. I was super excited when they finally announced that they were going to make uh, the Fat Boo. And now they're working on the Evil Boo. And I also pre-ordered that figure. So we'll uh, unbox that one in a future episode. But he looks amazing with the tongue out, the taunting face, the angry face, the chocolate, part of the cape. He looks on point. Like at the beginning of SH Figure Arts figure line, I was kind of skeptical. I was like, mm, they do look really nice and the articulation is great on these with these figures. But I always thought that they could be better. But over time, man... SH Figure Arts is nailing these Dragon Ball figures. I mean, look at the great Saiyan Man figure, for instance. He looks awesome, on point. Master Roshi looks on point. Margin freaking Vegeta, also on point. So, uh, yeah, I think that's it for the unboxing. So now, let's go to the final part of the video. So, as you can see, episode 15, we unboxed a lot of awesome figures, two of which are going to improve my art style and the future manga, of course. One product is perfect for the figure reviews that are finally going to be made after two years of promising it, and two awesome Dragon Ball figures that I really love. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. I got two awesome announcements, well I got two things to say, so before you go, hold up, hold up. So I saw, first thing, I saw that we hit 17,000 subscribers, so thank you, and what up and welcome to every single new subscriber. I hope you're having a good time, because we are going to have a good time at the end of 2018 and starting 2019, we are going to grow on a new f***ing level. But anyway, just wanted to say thank you. And also, a quick announcement. I already know a really dope thing. Uh, a big surprise that I'm gonna do for you guys and girls. I think in December around Christmas. And I'm not gonna say it, because that would obviously uh, ruin the surprise. So just wanna say it. There's gonna be a big surprise around Christmas. So that you can all, you know, start speculating what it's gonna be but anyway i want to thank you for your time and i hope this made your day even more awesome than it already was so i hope you had an awesome day i wish you guys and girls an awesome day and i'll see you guys and girls in the next video peace